You're watching 33 WYTV News at 6. Welcome back, everyone. We're going to get one last look at your forecast before we get out of here tonight. Ryan, those fall-like temperatures are here. It looks like they're here to stay. However, we have some sunshine over the next few days, so that softens the blow a little bit. Yeah, we're already starting to see the back edge of those clouds working in. This is a view from our sky cam out at the airport looking off to the west. You see the clearing out there. It's going to take a little bit to get that to work in here, but through the evening, we'll slowly see the clouds clear out, and that's when we start looking for some pockets of fog trying to develop. Now, temperatures will fall quickly once those clouds are gone. 45 degrees the low, so a little cooler out at the bus stop tomorrow morning. While well, I don't expect you'll need the umbrellas, you'll want the jackets and also could encounter a couple areas where the fog could get a little dense for the start of the day. Once that burns off, the rest of the day looking great, mostly sunny, a little warmer, 67 and the work week really looking fantastic here as temperatures throughout the week continue to warm up back to about low 70s by Friday. Work week looks dry. Next chance for wet weather comes on Saturday with some scattered showers and storms behind that storm system a little cooler again. Yeah, looking good for sure. And don't forget, Ryan's always got you covered over at WYTV.com for all your weather updates. And that's going to do it for us tonight on 33 News at 6. We'll see you right back here in 30 minutes for 33 News at 7.